Hey, haha, <laughs> hey, we, we are here again. How long can you cook? I'm telling you something. I'm just asking a question. How long can you cook? Now, there is this lady, an African lady. I'll give you a whole story about that. She has cooked her. Hmm. Even Saibanus. Is he Saibanus? He has gone to take his side of the, the plate. He's holding two plates. This lady can cook. And for four consecutive days, four continuous days, in a record of 96 hours. Wow! What a cook! Her name? Okay, hold on. You are welcome to the spotlight. It's a trending issue, and you cannot miss it. With the spotlight, we'll give you the best of the best. The best of news, the best of trending stories, and the best of relationship. Hey, indeed, the best of political stories as well. All right, so welcome to the show. And today we are here to give you the best of a trending issue that is packing up the entire African continent. Yes, but before I tell you about that, go to the subscription button. If today is your first time of watching our videos, press it. But if you're already here, you know what to do. Like our videos, comment on our videos. We'll give you the best snapshot of it. Now, today, what are we talking about? We are talking about Hilda Bassi. Hmm. Have you heard of the name before? Ah, you haven't. Today I'm telling you about Hilda Bassi. I don't know, even, even I don't know. Is she, a, is she related to Nathaniel Bassi? Ah, you know Nathaniel Bassi, the musician, the famous Nigerian, Nigerian musician? Well, there's been a contention. Ghanaians are saying this lady is a Ghanaian. Nigerians are saying she's a Nigerian. Well, whatever the case may be. That's why my intro I said it's a big news for Africa. It's a big news for Africa because this lady... She has cooked for 96 hours. Calculate. Four days. She started from Thursday and she ended yesterday, Sunday. Wow. What a wow. And she has cooked a total of 110 dishes. Isabel, Isabel, Ekurunti, Ghana, Hake, Obaye, Emune, Dua, Obaye, Fante, Fante, Obaye, Dokkadokun, Obaye, Benku. In Nigeria, this lady has cooked 110. Wow! No, you haven't had anything yet. Because this lady, she just dethroned a certain lady by name Lata Tondon. She is an Indian who was holding the Guinness World Record of cooking thon, cooking a thon, or better say, cook a thon. Yes, that's the name. Cook a thon. The cook a thon competition is someone who can stand on her legs or his legs and cook for a very long time. Now, that Indian lady had already cooked that record of 86 hours, 45 minutes. But the Nigerian lady said, hey, we are Africans. We can go beyond that. And I know after this video, you, yes, you can even do a hundred hours. Do it and we'll, 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 the spotlight will take you out to the whole world to watch you. Now, this Nigerian, as I told you, has done 96 hours of video. 96 hours of cooking. Cooking. And the only thing she did was, she didn't stop to sleep. She would just go and have a brief small food be some gary here and she'll come back and then come and cook continuously cooking continuously cooking she you know she's a a, a, a social media sensational lady she's a restaurant as well she she knows cooking so even as she started doing it, people thought she was there, yeah, no, no. But at the end of the day, she has made it. She has made it big. And now, the whole world, Ojina Nainso, of the whole Riyase, she's holding the record of her 96 hours cooking and considerably cooking 110 dishes. 110 dishes. How many can you cook? And how long can you stand on your legs to cook? Charlie, this lady deserves some claps. Uh, she de deserves some applause as well. And I think 
it's hard time people try to look into Guinness World Records eh? and then we break them one after the other. Someone was asked, which record can you break? He said, you know what? Give me a room, give me internet and food and let me stay there for the for 100, 100 days. <laughs> I don't know about you. I don't know how you want to break record, but this lady's record is sensational. Now, let's listen to some comments on social media. People are commenting on her, 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 her sensational work and her, her record-breaking feat. <laughs> but I love this one. Listen, listen. Somebody say this. If only this cooking can change Nigeria's narrative. Aww. Of course, you know, Nigeria has a, a, some juju mentality narrative. Some people are also saying Nigerian guys like internet fraud and what have you. So he is saying that if only this cooking competition and winning this feat can change the narrative about Nigerians. Indeed, the Nigerians are not just fraud people, they are not just these people, but they are good, hardworking personalities in Nigeria. I think this comment deserves some your comment as well. Don't forget, give me your comment. Tell me what you can also do. And let's put you on the spotlight and let's see what you can do. Okay? Write your comment. Tell us what you can do. Maybe you you can you can you can pump fufu, change the fufu into something else. Somebody said, Me, I've been as 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 a test now, I've been setting records. I'm still at the washroom. I've started pooping, I started pooping from 4.30 a.m. until now. My stomach is still paying me. I'm still there. That's why I record. Hey, Ghana folk. Ghana folk so somebody said congratulations. But I don't know what you are going to say. You say something and let's tell Let's tell the lady. Now, someone says here, he said, this is not a big deal. Hey, Ghana folk. Any Nigerian folk. Oh, see, this is not a big deal in cooking. If there is enough gas, I can cook more than that. Say congratulations anyway. <laughs> what can I drink? But she says that if you have enough gas, she can cook. She didn't add the cooking, you know, uh, the, the the items you need to cook with, the vegetables and what have you. What food are you cooking? Ah, also I be Let's continue. Somebody says, "Hey, Heda has cooked more than 110 meals so far. So Nigeria has up to over 110 different meals. And me, it be Gary, I they drink every day." But Nigeria over 110 dishes, and this lady has done it. Who the every day wash her? Gary, give me Gary, give me sugar. Sometimes on for bread, they make a crown count. Oh, 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 oh. But you see, that is why the spotlight is here. That's why we are here to give you the best of the stories. It's a trending video. Please don't forget. Send us your comments. Send us your comments. Me, I, I love reading the comments. Too. I love reading the comments. You see, somebody say, he is a Ghanaian. <laughs> Raymond, yeah, 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 boy. <laughs> what did he say? He said, is this an achievement? Hey, hey, you two. Go and invent something. Go and swallow the sun. Maybe that one is also your achievement. He said, is this an achievement? The white people are developing technology. Africans, only food. You to go and swallow the sun. If Africans are doing food, go and do something else. Ah, are they? Oh, <laughs> somebody is still asking. I mean, they're making energy. I say, is she still cooking? She has finished cooking. She ended her feet yesterday, Sunday. Huh? So if you, whichever time you are watching this video, I'm telling you that she has ended her feet. And it's an incredible 96 hours, say, four good days. And we are waiting for somebody to do five, six days standing on your feet to cook or to do something incredible. The spotlight will, will bring you out and the spotlight will talk about it. Hey, let me hear your comments, please. Don't forget to like our video and share it to somebody else because it's the best of videos you can ever have. This is the spotlight. Like our videos, comment, and give us a shout out. Eh? If you have not subscribed, please press the subscription button for me. Just press it. We want to make a bigger family. Join us and it will be great. Hey, we'll come your way again with another trending story and a great news. Hey, this is a spotlight. We'll meet again. Bye-bye.